Um, have you ever wanted to get a piercing, but you're too scared that it's going to hurt so bad? Well, the truth is, they do really hurt. And that's what I'm going to go over with you today. I'm going to go over how bad they hurt, how to keep them clean, and what the dangers are if you don't keep them clean. So first off, how bad they hurt, I have seven piercings. I have two low piercings. I have two cartilage piercings in my left ear, and I have an industrial bar through my right ear. I would say that the first ones is when I got out when I was 10, and those hurt the least because it's on a fattier part of your ear. And then I got my second ones when I was 17, my second low piercings, and those, they didn't hurt that bad. But as you go up your ear, truth be told, it hurts a lot more worse every time you get a piercing up on your ear. Then my cartilage piercings, I got them both done at the same time, so they hurt really bad because it's two needles going through your ear at about the same time. Then my industrial piercing, that hurt the worst out of all of them because if you don't know what an industrial bar is, it's a back cartilage piercing that's connected to a front cartilage piercing and it's just connected by a bar. And that one hurt pretty bad. But the way that I choose to clean them, I use a saline solution because that's what every ear piercer that I've gone to recommends for how to clean your ear. But you know, if you go to Claire's, then they'll give you a solution to clean your ear with and it'll be fun. And according to savepiercing.org, they think that a wound wash solution is the best way to clean your piercing because it like helps wounds, and that's basically what you do to your ear. You give them a wound, and then it'll help clear the process up. And also, with wound washes or any kind of ear piercing, what you don't want to do, you don't want to overclean them because then the wound will be open and that just gives it room to have more infection. And it's just, you don't want an infection because then your ear can reject the piercing or it can, it can not, it'll just hurt. It'll hurt a lot worse than your piercing ever did. And then we're going to go over the dangers of not cleaning your piercing. So if you don't clean your piercing, then obviously it'll get infected because you have to clean out all the gunk and stuff that'll come along with your piercing because I haven't heard of one person that does get by with, with not cleaning their piercing. Um, so yeah, so you just wanna make sure all the gunk is away and then you should be fine. But also, if you bump it, then your earring will get irritated, and then you'll have to clean it because then if you move the jewelry, it'll reopen that little area where your piercing goes through, and then you have to clean it so that it doesn't get infected. Okay. So, so what I went over with you today is how bad piercings hurt, um, how to clean your piercing, and the dangers of not cleaning your piercing. So hopefully you learned from today that if you do choose to be adventurous and get a piercing done, you will know to clean it and what to clean it with.